Welcome to my workshop. Today we are going to be making Dobby the house elf on the shelf. What you're going to need for this project is two sets of different fabric, three buttons, some wire, and some stuffing. This is the pattern I'm using for Dobby. Now what I'm doing is I'm just tracing out each item. For the arms and the ears, I am tracing out two. Once you're done tracing out, it is time to cut it out. Okay, now it's time to sew all our pieces together. So I'm gonna start by sewing the leg, and what I'm doing is I'm sewing from this corner, up top, down to this corner, and all the way to the top. Then it's time to flip it inside out. There's one of our legs. Do the same thing to the other one. Moving on to the arms. Turn them inside out. Now I'm just stuffing the arms and legs. Once those are stuffed, we're gonna take them and we're gonna do our body. So I have my top part of my body and I'm just laying the legs like that so they're long ways and this is the end of the feet. And then I'm gonna sandwich it in between, like so. And then I'm gonna pin it and sew over the legs. So when I flip the body part when it was sandwiched, it looks like that. Then I do the same thing with the arms. Now that that's done, we're going to go ahead and we're going to try to shove all the limbs through the top part, so the rest of the way, all the way around. And now it's time to flip it inside out. It should look like this now. It's time to stuff the body. <laughs> oh my gosh, this looks so funny! Oh. <laughs> now I'm going to feed the wire through the legs and it's going to make a giant V. It's going to go up into the neck and then I'm just going to put a wire across the arms. Because the stitching is so small, it's easy to get the small wire in it. When you're done, it should be able to be stiff and you should be able to move it around pretty well. You should have a wire right here for where the head is at. Time to sew the nose. Now I'm just making a slit right where the nose is supposed to go, right here. I'm just gonna go ahead and hand sew the nose on. Now that the nose is all done, I'm gonna go ahead and stuff it with stuffing. There's Dobby's nose. Now we're gonna do the ears. Okay, now it's time to flip it inside out. 
Now we're gonna sew the ears on. Now it's time to flip it inside out. Now let's attach the neck, but first let's stuff the head. Now that that's done, let's make Dobby's outfit. For Dobby's outfit, I'm just cutting out a long rectangle. And then I'm cutting out another rectangle right here. I just sewed up the side and now I'm just finishing off by tying it at the top and then it's going over Dobby's head. All I did was I pinned a sock, a baby sock, to his hand. Now I'm just gluing on the eyes and the mouth. There we go. There's our Dobby house elf on the shelf. Guys, it's all done and it looks so good. If you guys like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And stay tuned every Monday for a new video. Also, big shout out to Pins and Things who is also doing a Harry Potter Christmas week. I'll have a link in the description below for where to find pins and things. I will also have a link in the description below as to where to find all the materials for this project. So if you guys like this project and you don't want to make it, I will have soon a link in the description below as to where to find this on Etsy.